place where the land may see There is a home so sweet, the house of an artist With something to show us, painting pictures of brush and pen Up on the paper in a book that's so beautiful It is a joy to read because the stories you find In this book of wonders are some of the most amazing you will hear For the stories were inspired over the ages By God's Holy Spirit who guided your writers long ago John is the friar's name, and you will find with him Three friends so special, having fun all together Renata, Leopold and Tim, who want to share with you All the good stories that the friar John would tell And if you like, you can join these four friends And maybe stay for a while, and together we will play Or perhaps you would like to join in the chorus No need to worry if they sing a little out of tune If you prefer to play with the smallest so come, we are waiting in this holy place We're really sure that you want to hear the stories of our John The Wedding Feast Renata, that's beautiful. Oh, what are you sewing? It's a dress for Peppy. Oh, for Peppy. Ah, I didn't know you could sew. Yes, my mum told me how to do it. Oh. Oh, did you prick yourself, Renata? Yes. Oh, These are the sacrifices a mother must make for her daughter. But it's worth it. You're doing a beautiful job. I'm sure Peppy will love it. Thank you. I still have a lot to do. Oh, wow. Really? Yes. Huh? Oh, ow. Did you nick yourself again? Oh, yes. Let me see. But it's not a real needle. But it hurts too. Huh? Let's see. I'll bring you a band-aid. And also, I'll give you a thimble. A band-aid and a thimble? Let me see that finger. Huh? I'll put the band-aid on so it won't hurt anymore, OK? Oh. And now, I'm going to put a thimble on your finger. So you won't mm. hurt yourself mm. anymore. Oh, a thimble. Okay. Oh, a thimble. You won't hurt yourself now. Thank mm. you. Mm. Mm. I'll keep sewing then. Mm. You sew very well, we know. Children, did you hear the church bells? Mm. Yes. yes. The mass will start in 30 minutes. Oh. Jesus is waiting oh. for us in the chapel. Mm. Come on, let's pick up everything. Okay, Renata, let's go, let's pick go. up your things. Yes, but I want to finish the dress first and then go for a walk with Peppy. Yes. The thing is, I get bored at Mass. You get bored at Mass? That's because you don't know what happens at no, Mass. No, the truth is I don't understand much. Me neither, and I always think about other things. I don't understand anything uh -huh. at all. Uh -huh. Of course. Uh -huh. If you don't understand, you'll get bored. Yes. yes. Oh. yes. See? Oh. Oh. The Mass is like a great banquet in heaven. Uh -huh. Yes, oh, it's a party where uh, everybody's invited. Party? 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 And the host huh? is the creator of the universe. The creator of the universe? Oh, let me the see. one who created the sky, the oh. earth, the clouds and the mountains. And the sea. Yes, the sea too. All that water. All that wow. water. It's beautiful. Wow. I like it. The creator. And the king is waiting for us to come to his feast. Mm -hmm. OK, sure, I'm going to Mass. Mm -hmm. But first I'll finish Peppa's dress mm -hmm. and then I'll go for a walk with her. Mm -hmm. oh, I'm such a busy mum. Mm -hmm. So, you're very busy. Very busy. Like the men who declined the invitation of that king. What, what king, king, Father, Father John? John? The one in the parable. A parable, a parable, go and hear a parable. Oh, yeah, come on, let me see. Look, look, oh, let me see. Oh, come on, look, look. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, that's beautiful. A king gave a great banquet and invited his friends. He ordered his servants to prepare all sorts of delicacies. Oh, what a marvellous banquet. Hmm, they're bringing more. Hmm, put it over here. Hmm, hmm, ah. 
When everything was ready, he called his servant. Come here. Go and find all my guests and tell them that the banquet is ready. The tables, the food, the drink, everything is prepared. Hmm. The servant went to the ah. guests' houses as he was told. The first guest was a man who was very busy because of his business. Mm -hmm. Eight, nine, ten hectares plus the other fifty that I already had. That gives me a total of sixty. Hello, oh, my lord yeah. told me that the banquet is oh. ready and you are invited oh, to come. No, 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 I just bought a field and I must go out and see it. Please excuse me. I'll tell him uh, maybe another day. OK, goodbye. Oh. Well, there are more guests. But the second guest also I rejected the invitation, telling the servant that Look, he was very busy. Invitation. No, I can't. I can't go. I've just bought five yoke of oxen and I'm on my way to try them out. But please but excuse me. Tell him I can't go. I will go another day, but not today. I'm very busy. I have a lot to do. Waiting. Mm. Oh, well. But it's still... There are more guests. But one by one, the guests excused themselves. He's here. Hello? The banquet is ready and the king is waiting for his friends. Hello? Well, who is it? Who is it? Who is ah. bothering me? Hello. What do you want, eh? The king told me that. Everything is ready, eh? and you are invited. Oh, well, the king's banquet, I knew I was forgetting something. <laughs> well, the thing is, I can't. Huh? I can't because I just got married, you know. Uh, Please, but, tell the king that another day. Yes, another he... day. I can't go now. But the Lord? Oh. Huh? Who is the it, The banquet honey? of the king is ready. No one, my dear. I'll get inside. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, my. Nobody's coming. Now, what I'm going to tell to my king... Then the servant went back to his master's house, carrying this sad news. Wonderful, hmm? My lord, nobody's coming. What? Nobody is coming? Are they rejecting my invitation? Yes, my lord. Mm. Hmm. Go out quickly into the streets and alleys of the town and invite the poor, the crippled, the blind yes. and the lame. Then the yes. servant went into the streets and alleys of the city, looking for the poor and the crippled, the blind and the lame. Oh, I'm so hungry. Mm. Huh? Grapes, oh, they look delicious. Mm. Hey, hey, get mm. out of here. Get out of here. Oh, Don't yeah, eat my yeah. grapes. Get out of here, scoundrel. I don't have time for this. So hungry. Hello. Um, my lord invites you to his banquet. Me? Everything is ready, and you can Me? come right now if you wish. But I'm only poor, lame. Yes, you. My lord is waiting at home, and everything is ready. Wow! And will there be grapes like this? Of course. Are you coming? Yes, yes. Let's go. <laughs> Hello. You are invited to the great banquet of the king. Me? Everything is ready. But mm -hmm. I'm only a poor blind man. It doesn't matter. The Lord is waiting at home and you are invited. Am I invited to a banquet? Mm -hmm. And where will there be delicacies and delights? And can I fill my place? Yes, as many times as you want. This is wonderful. Can I go with you? Of course. Because I'm blind, you know. Oh, this is Let's so go. sad. I didn't know I was going to die so Hello. soon. Hello. My king has prepared a big celebration and you are invited to come. Uh -huh. yeah. But we're just a lame and a one-eyed man. Yes, you too. My lord is waiting at home. Everything is ready. And you are invited to Whoa. the great banquet. We must go yes. to this banquet. This Let's go. Incredible. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Those men went to the king's banquet and felt very happy to have been invited. I bet he looks good. The servant said to his master, What you have told has been done, hmm? but hmm. there is still room. Good. Go out to the roads and the country lanes and compel them to come in, so that my house will be full. 
I tell you, not one of those who was invited will get a taste of my banquet. <laughs> the servant went out again to the roads and lanes. You can come with me oh. if you want to. Look, oh. here oh. is the invitation. Oh. Yeah. What do you oh. say? Okay. Let's go. Mm -hmm. You can come with mm -hmm. me if you oh. want to. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yes, go. yes, I'll go. <laughs> Thank you. My lord has prepared a great huh? banquet. A banquet? Yes. yes. Oh, of course. You are oh, invited. Of course I'll go. Let's go. The servant came back with so many guests, and the king's house was full. Did you like the parable? It was beautiful. And those men who declined the invitation? I don't understand those men, because if someone invited me to a big banquet, I would certainly go. I would also go, and Father John. in that super extraordinary and delicious banquet, was there cheese? Probably there was cheese. Oh, then I don't understand why they said no. Because, according to them, they had too many things to do. And the same thing can happen to us with the Mass. But ah. the mass is not a banquet, like in the parable. No, it's much better. I've only seen a piece of bread. Yes, and a little yes, wine. Yes, a little wine. It's a not little... the same. It's not the Jesus same. Jesus says, my body is real food, and my blood is real drink. Anyone who does eat my flesh and drink my blood has eternal life, and I shall raise him up on the last day. Anyway, I can't eat at that banquet because I haven't received my First Communion. But you can feed on the Word of God. God himself yes. speaks to us during the readings of the Mass. Are parables also read at Mass? Of course parables are read. Really? Oh. Children, oh, the bells. Well, I must prepare the Mass and I'm running out of time. Great banquet is about Who's coming with me? I'm coming with you. There's still time. Well, as you wish. Let's go. I'll wait for you. Okay. Well, Pippi, here we are. Hmm. Let me see the dress. Well, it's very beautiful what Father John said. I've never seen the Mass as a celebration. And I didn't know it was a banquet. You either, right? Of course, Father John can eat from the banquet, but I can't receive Holy Communion because I haven't made my first communion. But we'll go to Mass anyway, right? Oh? Do you think the Mass is boring? Oh, but don't say that, Peppy. The Mass is a banquet. I'm sure you like the Mass, right? Well, I understand you. Some may think it's boring and slow, but... Some may also think you're a little bit boring because you only say no and yes with your head. Ah, oh, you're so quiet. I get bored. Ah, come see the music box. Come on, you'll love the music box. Oh, here, here's the music box. Ah, mm, you'll love this. Can you see it? Mm? Mm, it's so beautiful. Yes, yes, look, look. Ah, oh, it has a table with food. And can you see? And, and that man, he's, he's the king. Hmm.
Once a good king gave a party for his friends, a very splendid banquet he prepared. Then he sent servants to his most beloved subjects to remind them of the celebration day. Today I want to see you, you must quickly come because my servants' tasty dishes have prepared. The table is ready, let's begin the celebration, sharing happiness and joy all together. But those friends refused the invitation, none of them. Decide to change his plans, they all had reasons Apologies, excuses, explanations As to why they couldn't go I have some business, answered the first friend The king invited, I can't leave the work I have to do Another guest said, I'm sorry I would gladly come with you But I must see a field that I just bought When the servants gave the king his friends responses Angrily, he crossed them off the banquet list He decided to invite more grateful people Who were willing to respond to a loving call He sent out servants to all the corners of the kingdom To bring every kind of person who'd come in They were so happy to share in the king's generosity And so they filled the palace of the king The Lord is calling you to join his party His peace and love and joy he wants to share He wants to be your friend, he wants to be with you To be happy, you should listen to his call Don't be like those ungrateful friends who refuse the invitation I'm told the king they wouldn't go They missed out on the party cause they didn't want to accept the call John, Tim, Tim, that's it, Leopold, um, Rodolfo, <laughs> uh -huh. and Totti. Yeah, perfect. Hmm. Uh, I'm so excited because they're coming. Let me see. Oh, nobody's coming. Hmm. Oh, we see. Oh, it's a bit late. Mum, why haven't the guests arrived yet? Perhaps they couldn't come, Renata. It can't be possible. I told them ahead of time. Look, here comes Totty. Hello. hello. Hello, Renata. Hello. I can't come to your party. Oh. I'm sorry. My mum invited oh. me to the movies and I can't stay. Oh. I'm sorry. You can't? No. No, I really can't. Oh. Sorry. Goodbye. Goodbye, Totty. Oh. Oh. Oh, hello, Leopold. Leopold. Oh, hello, Renata. Look, look what I've done. Oh, yes, yeah. it's nice. But I can't stay. I'm sorry. Oh. No, because no? someone invited me to a pond and I really want to see it. Okay, oh. I must go. Goodbye, Renata. Oh. oh. Oh, it's so sad. Leopold can't either. Oh, Peppy, you made it. I came, but I can't stay, Renata. I don't have a proper dress. You certainly have a dress. Look, I need my finger two times sewing yes, it. Yes, Renata, but I don't feel good with it. I feel ugly. Oh. I don't like it, Renata. I'm sorry. Goodbye. Oh, but Peppy... Peppy didn't stay either. Hello, Renata. Oh, Tim, you came. Yes, That's I'm great. Here. But I can't stay. I came mm. to tell you... Look. Oh, you can't? Why? Well, because I'm going to play ball with oh, my friend at Tolfo. Maybe he's also invited. Oh, cool. I found the ball. Oh, Tolfo, you can stay okay. if you want. No, okay. no, you want to play but with the ball. Come on, Tim. Come on, let's go. Bye. Oh. Oh, oh, Rodolfo. Oh, listen, Renata, I'm terribly sorry, but one of my sons oh. just hatched from the egg. No. I can't stay. Sorry, Renata. Oh, you you understand, well. right? Oh, okay. Well, I wish you mm. great celebration. Mm. Goodbye, Renata. Okay, bye. Of course, I understand. Oh, Father John, you came. Nobody stayed. I'm sorry, Renata, but I must uh, leave. What? Goodbye. You? Oh, Father John can't stay at my party either. <laughs> Why are you crying, Renata? It's me, Jesus. Do you feel 
like this when we, your children, don't come to your banquet, the Mass? Yes, I feel sad when you don't remember that I gave my life so you can live happily in heaven with my father. You nicked your finger because you wanted to see your little doll beautiful and happy. Yes. Imagine my suffering with the crown of thorns and the nails. And on the cross, almost everyone abandoned me. That's why I'm so happy when you come to me at church, receive me in Holy Communion, and visit me in the tabernacle. I'll never forsake you. And now, be sure to go to Mass and receive Holy Communion. Every time you receive Holy Communion free of serious sin, your heart will be more and more like mine, and you'll learn to love me as I love you, with all your heart. Thank you, Jesus. Renata. 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 Oh, Father John! Oh, the beauty box. Uh, I dreamt that Jesus spoke to me. Is that right? And what did he tell you? He told me that. That he loves me very much. Oh, Father John, when is my first communion? Everything in its own time, Renata. First you have to finish the catechesis. Oh, that's true. But you are coming to my first communion, right? Of course. Oh, God. How are we going to miss something so important, Renata? Because sometimes people forget or can't go. Forget your first communion? Yes. Forget the day you'll receive our Lord? Uh -huh. That's impossible. Yes, oh, impossible. Thank goodness. <laughs> Although there was no party, the most important thing is that you're going to receive our Lord. Hmm. The King of the Universe. He loves you in a way that no one can. You know that, right? Yes, I know. But there are children who don't, because after they've received Jesus, they have a party and never go to Mass again. That's true. It's sad. Mm. They don't know yes. who they lose. No. Others have even mm. given their lives huh? to protect Jesus in the oh. Eucharist. There once was a child who was a saint. Oh, a saint! 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 Oh, 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 This boy lived in the time of Emperor Valerian, a cruel man who persecuted Christians. He put them in jail and killed them. To celebrate Holy Mass, Christians had to hide in the catacombs, which were caves dug underground. One day, Tarsisius offered to take the communion to those Christians imprisoned because of their beliefs. He was willing to protect Jesus in the Eucharist with his life. They didn't want to give him the hosts, but he convinced them, saying that no one would suspect a child. They gave him the consecrated hosts, which were carefully covered. He was walking to the prison, carrying the hosts full of joy, when a group of children invited him to play. Tarsisius said no, and they wanted to know what he was hiding so strongly. They suspected he was a Christian, accused him and beat him, leaving him badly wounded. But they failed to take the consecrated hosts away from him. A Roman soldier who had converted to Christianity tried to save his life. He picked him up and took him to the catacombs. Tarsisius died, holding his treasure in his hands, the body of Jesus. Oh, St. Tarsisius, oh. wow. Oh, what a beautiful story. Well, children, what oh. do you think about the boy who gave his life oh. in order to protect Jesus in the Holy Eucharist? Wow, he loved Jesus so much. Yes, because he knew that Jesus is the best huh? banquet. Huh? And I know that now. Yes. Yes, huh? and I'm going to Mass right now. It's sad to think of those children who don't want to say they're Catholic. Oh, oh boy, I think it's because they're ashamed. Uh, but dying to protect Jesus doesn't happen these days, does it, Father John? Oh. Well, there are still places in the oh. world where people risk their lives to go to Mass. Oh, is that true? They must hide. Oh. They must hide. In fact, this happened recently in China. 
there was a little girl who was praying in a Catholic church and a group of soldiers entered and locked the priest in one of the rooms. Then they desecrated the tabernacle, threw the ciborium to the ground and scattered the consecrated hosts. Then they left, leaving a guard to watch the priest. The little girl escaped, but returned at night and silently entered the church. She prayed for one hour, knelt down, took one of the consecrated hosts in her mouth and left without being seen. Knowing she was in great danger, she returned every night and did the same thing. She prayed for one hour and took one host with her mouth. The only witness was the priest locked in his room. When only one of the 32 scattered hosts remained, the little girl came back to the church for the last time. She prayed and took the last host with her mouth. On her way out, she accidentally made a noise and woke up the guard. Hmm? Oh. Wow! Little girl loved wow. Jesus so much. And Jesus oh, loved yes. her. Mm. Mm. I'm sure he took her with him to the celestial banquet oh. and she will be very happy. Oh, oh yes, not like yes. those people who didn't yes. want to go to the Lord's mm. banquet. Yes. Really foolish. Mm. Father John, can we sing the song mm. of the men who didn't go to the Lord's banquet? Yes. Oh, of course. Mm. Oh. Mm. I can't stay to sing the song because I must go to 12 mm. o'clock mass. I won't miss it for anything in the world. Oh. Oh, oh, goodbye, goodbye Renata. Goodbye. Don't forget to pray for us. Yes, pray for us. Wow. Renata was very happy to go to Mass. Wasn't she? She wasn't happy before. How could this happen, Father John? She accepted the invitation. Oh, like the poor people in the parable. Good. Once a good king gave a party for his friends A very splendid banquet he prepared Then he sent servants to his most beloved subject To remind them of a celebration date Today I want to see you, you must quickly come Because my servants tasty dishes are prepared Table is ready, table is ready 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 Desire to change his plans, they all had reasons Apologies, excuses, explanations as to why they couldn't go I have some business Answered the first friend the king invited I can't leave the work I have to do Another guest said, I'm sorry I would gladly come with you But I must see a field that I just bought When the servants gave the king his friends responses Angrily he pushed them off the banquet list he decided to invite more grateful people Who were willing to respond to a loving call He sent out servants to all the corners Of the kingdom to bring every kind of person who can in They were so happy to share in the king's generosity And so they filled the palace of the king The Lord is calling you to join his party His peace and love and joy he wants to share He wants to be your friend He wants to be with you To be happy you should listen to his call Don't be like those ungrateful friends Who refuse the invitation I'm told the king they wouldn't go They missed out on the party Cause they didn't want to Accept the call of his love They missed out on the party Cause they didn't want to Accept the call of his love They missed out on the party Cause they didn't want to Except the call of his love They missed out on the party Cause they didn't want to Except the call of his love They missed out